Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Thomas. Tonight we're back here with Planet Dolan, and tonight we got a new one. So, this one is another Reddit story with weird things that happened at our school. I think I mentioned back in the previous channel, I think about a pig, but other than that, nothing really. But if you guys got any own stories, let me know. But for now, let's see these weird things that happen at school. So, be sure to like, subscribe for more. Hope you enjoy. Let's go. Planet, Planet Dolan. Dolan. Oh, Andy. Right. I like your art style too. From a classroom strip club to a psychotic uh, Spanish teacher. Ow. Planet Dolan crew reenact some of the oh, best true I know that one. subreddit <laughs> about the weirdest things we've seen happen at school. Cool. I'm Pringle the one. Hey, Today, Pringle. I haven't seen in a while. Number 10 was submitted by the Dark King, King Tortoise. Uh, the King in middle school, okay, Dolan up. and a few other friends found yeah. their principal jerking into what looked like porn. Was he traumatized? Okay. Probably since Dolan can't get Oof. the image out of his head of jizz going everywhere. Did Luckily, the principal got fired, but not after Oof. a day or two of the incident. Another Oof. time, Dolan and a couple of different friends were walking to the library where they spotted a few empty beer glasses and the principal sitting on his desk Oof. vomiting. That Poor was principal. a pleasant sight. Number Poor nine principal. was submitted by okay, Phoenix, Phoenix Weaver. Weaver. Right. When Pandora was in third grade, there All was right. a restroom right there outside her classroom. In the middle of class, they heard the sound of a kindergartner or maybe a first grade boy crying in the boy's room. Mm -hmm. The teacher went to investigate. And from you the okay? classroom, Pandora and her classmates mm. heard him cry. I can't poop. Of course, they all gave each <laughs> other okay? confused looks, and some kids laughed. Suddenly, they heard the boy Ruff. yell, I need a book! Seconds for later, what? the teacher uh, scrambled hmm? looking for a book the boy would be able to read. Hey, Shima? Then, out of nowhere, everyone saw the teary-eyed uh, boy oh. standing in the doorway with his pants half down. <laughs> Pandora and her classmates I'm sorry, why? out and averting their eyes. But the poor uh, little guy just seemed about startled that? and confused. <laughs> That was many years <laughs> just ago. Nice legs. And Pandora sometimes looks back on the day and wonders if that poor kid ever looks back too yeah. and cringes in embarrassment. I Number eight was. was submitted by <laughs> Raul365. Okay. A lot of kids in Nixium's high school openly mock the dress code, and their really? reactions were more than a little strange. His science teacher saw helping with a shirt that read, Beer, now cheaper than gas. The <laughs> teacher used yellow duct tape to make an A over one of the E's to make it say bear, bear? instead. There were several okay. times where students came to class in their pajama pants for no reason. <laughs> Gooby came to school sucking on a pacifier. But uh, she got so many words from her peers that she took it out before the end of the day. The weirdest was McCollum, who dressed in a drag while wearing a wig <laughs> and a gown with obvious spaghetti straps. I'm sorry, no why? No other clothes underneath. A lot of students thought that was hilarious, but the words he got from the teachers were confused glances. Numbers. Okay, that's be interesting oh man okay pajamas yeah i've seen that back in my old school back in the day <laughs> you'd be surprised how lazy people can get especially since sometimes pajamas could actually i think double as like you know shorts you could just i think you just gotta wear some underwear underneath because yeah sometimes the straps might just show something that people were not meant to see hey someone had to say it <laughs> but still that had to be like a concentrated effort, you know? Anywho, next up, Lily the Random. Number seven was submitted by Lily the Random. All right. Last year in health class, animations and their best friend were listening to a boring lecture about nutritional foods which nobody else was listening to. The very faint smell of smoke oh. came in through the open door, right next to the bathrooms. A few mm -hmm. people started to notice, thinking it was maybe just a malfunction in the popcorn popper but soon mm -hmm. realized there wasn't a teacher's lounge where a popcorn machine would typically be. So After what happened? After about five minutes, some kid, Legna, really needed to use the bathroom. About three seconds later, he ran back Seriously? in the room screaming. The right. urinals, the urinals are on fire. Everyone was either You're shocked, kidding me, scared, right? or laughing their butts off. Uh, the teacher finally stopped lecturing and went to the best check? Turns out someone had oh. shoved a few wads of paper towels in each urinal and lit them with a lighter. No Why? one was cut. And it's still the weirdest event Andy has ever seen at any of her Were schools. Were they trying to the school or Number something? Six was submitted by Project CS. Okay. One time during gym, hmm. Honey Bits and her classmate were playing some freeze tag when a car drove into yeah. the parking lot. Two drunk guys got out and one uh, had a megaphone. The one with the megaphone started shouting at them to go screw themselves. Then the other guy started to run uh, after them. He attempted rude. to grab Honey Bits, but Jeez. the teacher punched them in the face, oh. and everyone was told to go nice inside. Blow. The school was on lockdown for the last two hours. The guys were arrested for attempted kidnapping and in possession of meth. Number that five explains was a lot, really? Dr. Sunshine 703. 
Right. On the first day of middle school, Robo, now. Robo saw a group of three girls and one boy from the next grade up. Eh? The girls were surrounding the boy's front side, talking in whispers and not looking too eh? suspicious. Robo could see the boy fully since she wasn't standing off to the side of him. What's going on? She overheard what they were talking about. That's when the boy pulled down the front side of his pants and the girls peered inside with smiles on their faces. Uh, they jumped hmm? back. Looking excited, one of the girls, Doopy, said, Damn, that bitch is hard. And Robo slowly walked okay, away. The next day, him. Robo told her friend what had happened, then went to the office to tell them. Later on in the school year, Fair enough. the same kids, along with a few more people, threw water bottles at Robo and her friends. She never Pricks. mentioned what she saw because then it would start rumors, and everyone would bully her and call her snitch, saying it was her fault. Number four Bro, was submitted you're the by one that Steph dropped your drawers. One day at school, mm -hmm. Lady Bob was headed toward the staircase which led to the cafeteria. Spinal Palm mm -hmm. grabbed her shoulder. Mm -hmm. He looked like something happened to him. He told her, No. And Lady Bot looked at him confused uh, and again. What? He said, No. She asked, No. No what? No what? Then he just yelled, No, 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 no. Spinal Palm fell uh, to the ground and just whispered, Okay. Lady Bot tried to help him, but he literally said nothing but no for what seemed like forever. She helped him up and walked huh. to the cafeteria, still confused. Number. I'm surprised she didn't just stick around and be like, no, why were you saying no for? Like, honestly, that would be my first, like, thing. Like, focusing on, like, hey, man, you okay? Why are we just going, no, 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 no. Like, I mean, hey, I gotta make sure everyone's okay. Also, back to, you know, number five. Like, why? What the heck was that for? Let's be real. Like, if I saw that, I would have just been like, you know what? Screw up being called a snitch. I'm going to tell. Like. That ain't right. Sheesh. Anyway. Number three, three. was submitted by Pop Tart Troll. All right. A lot of weird things have happened in Ghost Toast. This should be good. Like the principal throwing a child into a wall or the unexplained Oof. hole in a lunchroom wall. Yeesh. The weirdest, by mm -hmm. far, has been the new Spanish teacher. One day he was yeah. reading in front of the class and seemingly got angry. He stood up, pulled the bag out, and started screaming, Gato! Gato! Pulling out oh. a plush cat, he proceeded to throw it eh? across the room. Scaring most of the students. Soon after the Spanish teacher mysteriously uh, why? Quit, it was mid semester and he just never showed up again. To this Did he day, just have a nervous breakdown or something? Left or why he even gave lessons like that. Number two was submitted okay, by Captain Lady weirdo. Bob. Shimo was running late for trigonometry, so she speed walked down okay. the hallway until she reached a door. She grabbed the doorknob, ready to explain to the teacher why she was late, and opened the door. Shimo was okay, expecting then? to see a fellow classmate sitting in their seats writing notes for that day's lesson. But no, oh no, she must saw something completely the? different. She saw that all but one of the lights were off, and all the guys in that class were only in their underwear, grinding and dancing. Uh, and what? All the girls were throwing what money at them the and cheering them on. The teacher was nowhere in sight. Shima just stood in the door, shocked and trying to process. You just want to go to the library? She just well, let's just get out of here. Door, went down the hall, <laughs> and sat in the library for that class period. What the, the next fuck day, was that? all the students in that class were suspended. Someone had taken photos of the makeshift strip club and posted Dude. them online. Shima got off Smart Scott play, Shima. Smart play. In it. Number Smart one play. Was Smart by play. Me, your narrator, Pringle the one. All right, Pringle, what do you got? What's the weirdest thing I ever saw happen at my school? Well, it has huh? to be this one time where I was in middle school where there were yeah. two guys. These guys, man, they were about to duke it out on each other. They were really mad. One of them tossed chocolate milk on his tray and he was about to knock his head off. Chocolate Loosely. milk? He was just about to get carried off and he was okay. just about to fight him. He was getting to his face, put his fist up, and then they just started hugging each other. Yeah, eh? they started hugging each other, and there was no fighting just, afterwards. That's it? They just became friends. Well, that was fast. And I was very confused. I was You're telling me. I wanted to see some Street Fighter type stuff happen. <laughs> when and we in all... The end, it was just straight thug loving. Huge thug loving. For the <laughs> okay, you gotta admit, that's kind of funny. Just thug loving. <laughs> oh, I swear, that's a good one. <laughs> Woo. Well, there you go. The weirdest things that happened at school. Uh, let me know if, you got, if any of these stories just, like, reminded you of anything. Let me know in the comments, because I love to hear. But for now, I think that's going to be it. So thanks for watching, everybody. Till next time, see ya.